A very good morning to you. Thank you so much for keeping it to Y254. Now, my name is Ram Aguko. It is a pleasure being with you on this fine Thursday morning. Now, this is Power Talk. As always, it is a pleasure being with you each and every Thursday. A repeat of this show airs again every Thursday at 10 p.m. And, of course, we value your feedback. The hashtag, as always, is Power Talk Show at Ram Aguko and at Y254 channel. And of course, engage with us. We value your feedback. Let us know where you're watching us from. Now, today, it's all about women. Of course, um, it's been a while. It's been a while since we had a conversation just with ladies on set. And today, I just have uh, ladies joining me in studio. And uh, of course, um, uh, when you talk about women, uh, I am a supporter of women, as I always say. But today, we want to question a few of uh, 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 the things that ladies believe in when it comes to relationships. This morning, let's talk about women and money. Let's find out, why do women always have this saying that my money is my money, but your money is our money? Why do we do that? Women and money. When it comes to finances, who invests more? Who should invest more? Sometimes men are poor when it comes to financial, uh, financial management. Lakini, there is a time that you go to the supermarket and you love to hold her hand for financial management <laughs> all right although it sounds romantic but of course we uh, uh we want to find out more what do women want when it comes to finances women and money to my far right i am with ruth mudoni uh, ruth mudoni who is a property advisor and of course a uh, tv host and the media personality kadu sana ruth thank you so much kosalama kosalama kabisa uh, and uh, next to me i am with violet mumbi a property advisor also and uh, an actress kadu sana violet Thank you so much, Ram. Uh, Munakas. Mm -hmm. Hey, okay. Mm -hmm. Women with money, tunaka pesa. Munaka pesa. <laughs> Munanuka pesa. <laughs> Munafanana na pesa. Muna meta meta kama pesa. Pesa in a Twitter by name. Eh? Mm -hmm. Ningekuwa upande ngine ningeuliza munakunyo nini alafu nungeyewa kapa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but of course, uh, uh, we want to find out women and money. And uh, let me start with you, Ruth. Um, do you believe that uh, women should have uh, should, first of all, independence. Should women work hard to be independent first before they get into any relationship? Oh yes, women need to work hard to be independent. Mm -hmm. A man comes to be a companion. Mm -hmm. So why would you not, why would you wait for that companionship? And let me tell you, a, a man, when a man comes and you're not financially stable, this mm -hmm. man anakuzanga nakukalia kidogo. Mm -hmm. Because now, okay, there are some people who say, if I won't get money mm. now, I'll get it through marriage. Yeah. Uh, because maybe the money is financially stable. Mm. But for me, I'd advise women to be more financially stable before they get into any relationship. But now, many women believe that um, when they get into marriage, as you mentioned, because the man is a provider. So they want to work um, you know, uh, uh, as much because they know, of course, I'll get married. Person in one moment, a letter here with the provider. So there is not much effort because, if anything, you will leave your father's house and be joined with the man. And um, are, you, are you a believer of that, Violet? I do not believe in that, honestly. Gonna, gonna the days when women never used to go to work, it mm. only uh, used to be men who are supposed to go to work and come back with money. The so you believe, you believe women should be independent? I believe women should be independent. It's a case closed. If you're a woman and you're <laughs> seated at home and you're waiting for the man to go and bring... Gone are those days when we used to do the traditional work. Because mm. kufua, kupika, and that's it. Mm -hmm. And then you just wait for the guy to go to work and bring you money. Ati mwanaume akitaka kujua kama we ni wife material. Angalika unajua kupika, uh -huh. kama unajua kusha vyombo, uh -huh. kama unajua kusha vyombo, nini um, manguo, uh -huh. anakuleta kwa nyumba, uh -huh. anakutest, uh -huh. anakombe ebu ni pikia ugali. Uh, if, if, you are living in, if you are living that way right now at this age and era, uh -huh. honestly uko nyuma sana, kiakili. So, so test ya, kiakili? Kiakili yuko nyuma. For a woman? <laughs> yes. <laughs> for a man, for that man who believes that they need to put a, a woman at home to test them. Uh -huh. Actually, that man who mwenye anaweka mama kwa nyumba anasema wewe usifanye kazi, I will do everything. Mm. What's wrong with you? Let that woman work because she's beyond that. So the test, what is the tester 
for lack of a testometer. <laughs> <laughs> you are not a testometer. Who <laughs> <laughs> kwapo si kukuwa tested? Who kwapo kukuwa tested? Who kwapo kufanya kazi? Right, uh, uh, mm. But money is money and cooking is cooking. Azile, azikuji. But sasa wana, atu, atu angali pesa kwa upana uh -huh. mwanamke. Mm -hmm. Every time, mm -hmm. when a lady says, I want a man, they always mention one person, one aspect, financially stable. Oh. But for women, do, 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 does any man ever, ever, even mention financial stability? And when that's to why men find, um, men find women who are educated and very... Uh, what can I say? They find men, uh, they find women very intimidating. Because mm. it's very, uh, you f you, yes, you guys find women who are very educated and have good jobs and earning good salary very intimidating. And that's true. Ram, is it true? Uh. Yes, please answer the no? question. <laughs> <laughs> um, I will say no. Mm -hmm. Why? Women, even men, we some men get mm -hmm. um, uh, attracted to mm -hmm. women with brains, beauty and mm -hmm. brains. Mm -hmm. Without money? Some person will to find See, I'm the provider. <laughs> See, he's in the man, the provider. <laughs> and we come to compliment. You come to com We compliment is, each other. Is it a must that a woman gets a job before no, they get into a, a relationship? It's, on, it's not a must and it's an individual, um, it's something individual if you want to work or you want to stay home and take care of the kids. Uh -huh. Is it a and must for a man? And you can still do, it is a must for a man. You see, oh, this yeah. is the problem. <laughs> <laughs> is this is the problem. For a man. But you're the provider, what do you mean? You can, we can't be sitting in the house together. Which brings me back to the question I asked you, is it okay for a woman to seek financial independence before getting mm -hmm. into a relationship or marriage? Mm -hmm. It's not a must. Mm -hmm. <laughs> for, for me, I feel uh, both of both of us should seek for financial independence, mm -hmm. and I feel that it's good if the man is also is working and the woman is also working because I can say uh, life happens. The man can lose a job, and mm -hmm. then the lady. That's when they come in and help. So mm -hmm. it's good for a lady. I, I I think for me, I feel like it's good for a woman to look for financial independence before getting into a relationship mm. because it will it will it will help you know you are you are in a relationship you are not there to uh, suck this uh, <laughs> it's a relationship <laughs> because both of you are consuming the, the whatever is happening in the relationship so i feel it's uh, it's it's very important for both the lady and the man to have a job to have something going on for themselves now let me mm -hmm. let me give a, a, a different mm -hmm. example. Mm -hmm. um, we have some women who believe mm -hmm. that uh, if they work and they get some money and they get into a relationship, mm -hmm. then mm -hmm. whatever amount of money they earn or mm -hmm. get mm -hmm. should not be shared. Mm -hmm. But the money that ought to be shared mm -hmm. is the money acquired by the man. By the man. Do you believe in that? I don't believe in that. It's good also as a woman. Up and I'll talk to women with mm. all honesty. Una changia. You know, you like, um, okay, the man can be there and uh, provide everything that you require in the house, the kids, the, everything that you require, you know, the, the, the basic stuff. It's good for a man to provide that. But it's also good for a woman to have her own money that at least aneza kuwa anaongezea. Mm. Uh, uh, to do some other things can ladies personally. do that really yes can ladies do that ati anasema acha nikuongezee hii hapana hatukuongezee but then we won't put it that way <laughs> get me right nikwambi na kuongezea pesa unasema utafanya i'll just go do my own thing without having to tell you by the way anataka kufanya kitu fulani na fulani but yeah, sio mwanaume nyumbani na stress anashindwa mm -hmm. atalipa the rent au mm -hmm. umeenda kufanya vitu vingine sasa zingine. ikifika hapo na na rent na nini and you know it's about honesty you, if you are my man and you come and tell me maybe i have this uh, kuna shida kumekuwa job kumeenda this and that and I am a woman and I'm there, at least I have something going on. Mm. So I have to because the man doesn't have money. Your belief? I think in a relationship, everybody has a part to play. 
for a man, for example, if we are dating, not even dating or married, a man pays the rent, does this and this, and mostly for the women is buying shopping. And after that ram, I am broke the whole month. Mm -hmm. <laughs> even if I have money, I am broke. You will meet women outside. Not uh, your spouse will tell you, I'm broke every time. And for them, money is in the bank, yes. But we believe you have to take care of us. That's why you... If you didn't come to take care of me. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to take care of me. Your yeah, book. yeah, there are some things that I personally as a woman have to do in the house. And you as a man, that's your responsibility to pay rent, school fees, mm -hmm. the simple, simple things. And that's an agreement. So mm -hmm. after that, Ram, I am broke the whole month. <laughs> broke. So I God. want money for this and this you provide. My goodness. Yeah. Boy child, we are suffering. <laughs> What, so, what about in a scenario whereby mm -hmm. it is the woman that earns more than the man? Mm -hmm. And you both know that clearly. Mm -hmm. How do you handle that? Apo, honestly, tunaelewa huna job uh. and uh, the lady is working. She's financially stable. But what effort are you putting are you looking a for a job? Yes, as a man. Mm -hmm. Are you looking for a job? Uneza kuwa pengine ni job hauna, umekuwa kijaribu kutafuta, dropping CVs here and there, trying to do something, vibarua, you know, at least you get even uh, 200 or 500 or 1,000 in a day. Are you doing that? Are you putting in the effort? But if you don't have a job and the ladies are doing better than you and you're not doing anything about it, that is not a relationship. But you know men are... Uh, uh, obviously looking for jobs out here out here sometimes the the jobs delay mm -hmm. sometimes you know, ram, um, 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 let me te tell you ram it's not about how much you're earning but you know you don't have to earn six figures for you to be called a provider you only need if you even if you earn ten thousand or five thousand in a month and you're doing something and you know no 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 Mm. Nisema, enye, this is what I earn, but today I say I buy two kitu kidogo, we eat. That's a if, provider. If, if you earn mm -hmm. more money than the man, mm -hmm. would you want the man to take care of your personal ex expenses? If I earn more money than... Your saloon? If yeah. I earn more than the man? No, not really. Apo, <laughs> boy child. Takuwa ni mefinyilia sana. Ruth, if you earn more than the man, lazima should he take care of your expenses? No, no, manicure, no, no. pedicure, and saloon, and uh, no, I see. think I think I'm the one to take care of him because it's a companionship mm -hmm. and a part. Let's mm -hmm. say even it's a partnership. I'd take care of him because even him, it's just a time. It's it's mm -hmm. a time mm -hmm. whereby he's not going. The his finances are not okay. It doesn't mm -hmm. mean he'll stay there forever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if I take care of him at mm -hmm. that period, when that money comes he will come back yes. and take care of me. He's also doing something about it. Yeah, he's doing something about it. Yes. She then you know, the, the, the 10,000, you go drink, come late, at you're stressed. Mm. Now that's not acceptable. Mm. Mm. Kama haliti pesa, mm. would you allow him to go out with the, the boys and, uh, uh, and say, you know what, me that I can do it, and I can do it. Will you allow them to do that? Anenda kufanya ni. Anenda. Na haliti pesa, what do you mean? <laughs> No, it's me. unacceptable. Someone know me when you have a person, if I can doubt. Once in a while, now once in a while, maybe ni once. But in a long while. In a long while. And then I'll talk to me a person. And I'll talk to me a person again. You can doubt. Hey. Ama ama anenda na baby wana boys. Hey. Quotes. My boys. So 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 me say ma ni companionship. Iyo na si companionship. So nampati ya as a companion. Labda ni asubui. But the best time to go out is mm -hmm. at, June, night. at night. But Ram, honestly, it doesn't make sense to me. How late you pesa kwa nyumba, but mm. you're going out. To do what? Because I believe. What are you going to do by Kazi way? ya itafutu yu siku. Lakini, uh, unamanisha kutafuta kazi ya makuenda kusherehe. Si, si umenda sherehe. Sherehe. Un, unaenda sherehe usiku. Na huna pesa. Si kazi una, umetafuta mchana ukashindo. <laughs> Sasa, as the girlfriend, you... 
no, 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 that's not Chafu acceptable. Uh, that's not acceptable. Uh, huh? that, that, that's, uh, to me, you know, I know men associate uh, money with freedom and power. So if you are that man, you're going out, usherehe, na ujacha pesa kwa nyumba, you're not being a man. That one I'll tell you for free. Somebody who cannot bring money Yes, at but you're out is there. not a man. Yes, you're not being a man. Isn't that too much pressure on the men? It's not pressure. You know, we have basic things in life. You know, when we look for money to figure at a certain level, we feel we have that financial freedom. That's only as I end out. When things are sorted, where? Back home. But you can't be out there. Na hata ukuacha hata ten bob or anything. You're just out there having fun. Honestly, that you're not you're not playing your part as a man. There are some men who, mm -hmm. of course, who you have a sugar, not not sugar, <laughs> baby, mama. Baby mama. Yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, another kapesa, mm -hmm. maybe a month, kila wakati. Mm -hmm. But when when a lady calls him, and mm -hmm. asema kila time, sina pesa, sina pesa, sina mm -hmm. pesa, mm -hmm. and and and. Um, the woman gets tired because mm -hmm. you want him to provide for the baby mm -hmm. if anything ni mtoto wenu but anasema hana hana pesa unafikiri ni kuso um i think in that situation kama hana pesa na asikuja kuona mtoto <laughs> reason being ha, si ati hana pesa ni priorities yeah, hana there's a difference of hana pesa ama hana priorities mm. you can't tell me a day to day maybe uh, that that guy has another girlfriend and they are okay. They are mm. okay. Na kuna mtoto mahali. It doesn't matter kama ata kuna mtoto isa idengine. But you have to provide for your child. Regardless of the situation. So kama hana pesa, akai kwenye yako, mtoto akai. You can't be coming to see your child and you're not providing for that boy or girl. But it is his child. So why are you coming <laughs> to see? <laughs> what are you coming to see? The child. Then come provide first. Provide, then come see your child. If he does not give money, if will you allow him to see the child? Not necessarily money, Ram. It's not about the money. Mm -hmm. you, he can even buy shopping at Umi. He can even pay rent directly to the enemy. We don't want the physical hard money, cash. the uh -huh. hard cash. No. Buy, buy food to mana. Rent, lipa directly. Come on, Wezi. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to Nepate time kidogo, na recover, kuna deal na ngoja. Nisawa, but kuna pesa kidogo aneza to at least, you know. Nye well. nime kuambia, kukua na pesa mingi, but it doesn't make you a provider. Yeah. Neza kuwa na pesa mingi and you're not doing anything. With, you don't have your priorities right. Ziko upside down. You have money in your bank, but you have a child there and you're not doing anything about it. But kuno yu menye unawana truly. He's not earning, he doesn't have a job, and truly on a field, but they have provide because Hana, Hana Kazi. Hmm. If he's honest about it, upon to Nezakailiwana. What is your thought in regards to um, mm -hmm. men who squander mm -hmm. women's money? Pesayako. That's a lazy man. You are lazy, and you are you, you are actually not really a man. You have to, to jump to this other side. Which other side? This other side of the women. Ni mama. Tuku, yeah, exactly. To go to the end of women's conference, Pamoja. You cannot be a fully grown man who's squandering a woman's money. I think the reason as to why they do that is because they do not want the woman to have more power than, them, than him. Yeah, and they feel so, intimidated. Yeah, and they mm. don't want to see that woman prospering. And that's why uh, women's money lasts long in terms of value. Because mm -hmm. us, we will invest. Mm -hmm. Us will do mm -hmm. things that we'll see in five years to come. You For the men, if you guys get money, you see cars, you see apartments, you see material, material things. And but for us, our money will stay. You believe that uh, mm -hmm. a woman's money lasts, but a man's money doesn't? Yes. 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 But only a literate woman or a mm. literate man. By the way, that woman who lets you squander her money... Maybe Nule and Ajua Kenya Anafanya. She has already put her money into her investments. Yeah. She already has, the, has her priorities done. She has invested in her family. She has invested in her people. 
And if you're there, you're squandering her money, thinking that you're bringing her down, mm. you may be a bit lost. At the end of the day, you when you may to is a potter. Um, another example still. There's mm -hmm. some women who um mm -hmm. invest. Mm -hmm. So my summer is a companion. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's uh, uh Mona. Mm -hmm. You know, you, you chip in. He yes. does this. You do yes. that. Yeah. Yes. But at we are talking a, a, about a time when the man is not able to. Mm -hmm. And so it is the woman that is investing. Mm -hmm. The woman gets a loan here and there mm -hmm. and I'm lipia a few mm -hmm. bills here mm -hmm. and there. Mm -hmm. Sometimes even school fees. Mm -hmm. And I'm a buyer of a and I rent. I love you know, the woman, mm -hmm. um, they, they say together, come and stay. maybe they're in campus or they're both working. Mm -hmm. um, and one day the guy decides to <laughs> disappear disappear <laughs> after he's now financially stable apart a job i don't think it's working between us mm -hmm. it has never worked when our man has money <laughs> it has never worked <laughs> it's not I even job. it has never worked <laughs> when the man gets when it gets to that time and then the man gets money ah. it has never worked in Akwanga, issues after issues and after issues. You said if a man is poor, it will work. But if ah, a man is rich, the relationship won't work. It will it's work. There will be problems. It will work. Kwanza, when it comes to a place where we found each other, uh. and then you, you are not financially stable. Uh. Then at, at some point, you got a good job, good finances. Hapo sasa ndio macho yako inafunguka. <laughs> Umeona wasichana wa rembo. <laughs> Sasa ndio unataka kwenda ku visit all the nice places and uh, trips. Mm -hmm. uh, it has never worked. Mm -hmm. So I'd rather me come into your life when I'm educated, financially stable. You educated, financially stable. Now we can reason together. But would you like would you prefer a man who is who lacks money? Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. you're talking about empowerment. Mm -hmm. You know women empowerment. Would you like to be empowered? more than the man mm -hmm. in this case would you prefer a man who doesn't have money i, I will not prefer because damu rumia to kidogo for now niseme acha tu ni ngangani but so mesema a man who is poor mm -hmm. kumdate ni raisi kuliko a man who is rich ni me uh, no mm -mm. Huh? you didn't get it no. right hapana <laughs> you said it won't work with the rich person with someone who has money and it will work with somebody who lacks money no if we are both financially stable yes. it will work uh -huh. but when i am maybe financially stable and you you're not it's a na shida mm. what about you are financially financially stable i am not mm -hmm. and then a time comes when i mm. become financially stable mm -hmm. it now depends with how i treated you when you were not financially stable because mm -hmm. the moment you take that you you just grab that money you will vice versa whatever I did. What should women go for? A man who is financially stable mm -hmm. or a man who is not? Go for a man who is putting an effort. L look for a man who is a, a provider. Don't just look for money, by the way. Because we are financially stable. Na kue, they are mean with their money. Mm. They are not providing, they are not doing it. Um, um, pesa, but whatever they offer is not what this person and mm. Maybe they have money, but whatever they offer is so little. So it's good. Unakuapia, unakuapo tu katikati. You use a discerning spirit to know. Okusema katikati na manjani. Yani, una, you just, unakuwa tu, uh, unakuwa tu careful when you're choosing. Yeah, you look, you look closely. This person amekuja kona pesa. What oh, can this person offer? Offer? Katikati, meaning eh. you you don't commit. No, I didn't say you don't commit. Do you I said you commit. I mean, eh. kukua katikati, not that you kuna both financially and eh, eh, eh. unstable and stable. What I mean is before you make that decision, mm -hmm. be careful and think vizuri before you make that decision of whether having a man with money or not. Have options. Mm -hmm. you kuna many people at the same time. I'm saying you try and and listen to them. But they, you, you know you men, because then I sit down with you for like um, three dates or so. Uh. There are many things I can tell about you. 
Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that is yes. catty. So, <laughs> yeah, it, <laughs> yeah it, it should be. By the way, it should be. And sometimes you may do not even know to how to lie. You don't know how to follow up lies with lies. So it will get to a point and I'll know the reality. They'll know this person a kona pesa but very arrogant and mean. This person does not have money, but I know akiwa nazo, he can be very supportive. So it is up to you, the lady, to know nyinani unataka kuendea between those. Uh, on Facebook, to Monza Palace, Wali, uh, what do women do with their money? Invest. Women invest in Most their money. Most of the women invest. <laughs> <laughs> Most of the women, women invest. Invest. Yes. Let's talk, okay, let's say, let's not say every woman invests. There's another percentage of women who don't even Kuna wengine wako na pesa lakini kila saa ni simu 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 nitumie hii nitumie hii. Ah. What is wrong with women? Akikwambia mtumia anaongezea kwa kashamba fulani alikwanga amenunua mahali. So women are con men. No we are not. Yeye ni con man. No we are not. Tunakusaidia uache kwenda sherehe utusaidie kwa kitu nitweke mahali. By the way being, being being a property advisor I have realized uh, most percentage of women are investing. Yeah. But there are many women own properties mm. and I'm mm. so surprised to see that because even like uh, over 60% of the title deeds I give are for women. So we are wondering, men, what is happening? Ama uh, uh, she, your she, wives. Your pesa muna invest na isi mwetuwa kwetu. Umepigia ramu kwa mbe ramu na itaji di 5k, 10k, 20k. Bati siwe ramu unataka kutufuraisha. Situfuraisha basi. Nipia mkai. Evo Ngo Cheng pale Facebook wanasema, you know, when you get old you will understand why your father was sitting out of the house alone in the in the evening. Uh -huh. Akiwa huko nje hakuna mtu anajua mfuko yake na kutu, na, 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 na kutoa to stress asifik, uh, asifikirie and uh, uh, and out to amenda. By the way, our fathers like saying sitting outside. outside. Yeah, with a kagazeti. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Wanawake. <laughs> <laughs> Brian, Brian Januzaj anasema wanatumia credo na pesa ya matumizi kwa mipango yao ya kando and it's true. The men? We, women. Oh. How do women use their money? That's a question That's to pale Facebook. Na huh? <laughs> what do women do with their money? Nasema mnatumia kwa mipango ya kando. You will tell us about that. LCM Caxton Munesh anasema watching our time mutiandui meru uh, they use their money to buy makeup and things their husbands don't give them. Yes. Prex de pato. And some are clothes, cosmetics, and more eating. Hey. Evans and some are good answer. Hata wewe ulitoa, ulitoka babako si angekuja na kisiagi. Nini yo si elewi kitu nasema hapo. Rash Bashir Were wa Busia nasema watching out of 40 Jesus Busia. Asante sana. Silver King nasema wanabai luku wakue on fashion. Uh, Abigail Francisca. Hey, ziko me, ziko mingi. Anasema, uh, uh, this is a lady. Anasema, for, for me, uh, I pay rent, school fees, shopping, buy clothes. It is like I settle all my bills with my money. Pato Wamesh Pato anasema, Tuned in from Nyeri, Asante sana pato Muguna, Boda Boda, Isiola, and some they spend on makeup. We'll talk about that particular issue of makeup. Lenson KE, and some they save in case Kiumane, Ama, eh, ati Ana Umeria. Ama, yoni ki, Ana Umeria. Yoni sheng ama kikuyu yu. Ati, Ana Umeria. Yoni sheng. Ayi. Muguna Boda Boda Isiolo. Nasama they spend on makeup. Russia, Jose, nasama count me in. Simon Clinton, Ndambuki. Nasama they use their own money on transport na kutuhanya pesa. Eric Migos. Nasama you can't even understand them. You can't understand women. Badman Mwega nasema anatuona pale producer Magusta Babu anasema MK2 Records 001 na sana sana culture kia anasema buying personal effects hametaja jina hapo moja moja mbili tatu hivi asante sana and of course keep on talking to us tuambi unaoju ukiwa wapi and of course pale kwenye Facebook and ensure that you like the page follow us on Facebook that's at Y254 what do women do with their money? 
That's the question. What do women do with their money? And of course, um, uh, uh, keep talking to us. I shall read more about about that. Now, now, when you nasema mamba makeup, kuna Robert Mudea nasema mamba bundles na chips. I have a ram. na wakitu wanomo nasema. Osa, men. I don't ah. know what's happening, but Ram, honestly, how much makeup as women do you use? A lot. <laughs> I mean, you don't, buy, you don't <laughs> buy makeup every day. How much does uh, makeup Th even? That's actually what I'm answering. You know, you don't buy makeup every day. Yeah. Makeup is something you buy once in a while. And it lasts you longer. It Lipe depends. Yeah. It depends with the, with the, with the level. Na hitu chip kidogo kuna hii mm. kuna makeup ya kila mtu yeah. in every class. Yeah. So kuna ile makeup more expensive. Sasa kama ni makeup cheap sana inaweza kuwa how much? Cheap. Makeup can be anything from 200 bob. So I don't 200 years ni kitu ndogo kama hii uh, yes, kidogo yangu. And it can last you. No, mi tunasema uh, makeup. Uh -huh. Kuna make up. Uh -huh. Make up. So the whole thing. Yes. Mm. The cheapest in is how much? The whole thing. Maybe two three thousand to five thousand, the cheapest. Cheapest? Yeah. Na munasama ti munataka pesa yetu. <laughs> but the Now, thing is and you spend three thousand on things you apply on your face and you wash them. But these the are things you just buy once in a while. So if if you are if you're a woman who's earning good over fifty thousand in a month. And you only use five to ten thousand for makeup that will last you for six months. I don't see a problem with that. You're treating yourself because you're the one who is working. You're the one who's sweating. So it's easy to make makeup in your heart. Yes. You need pesa mana ume mingi ne ame ame ni pesa yetu. Ni pesa yetu apa taka after to mesha invest. I want us to take a short break. We'll be back after this. We are going to talk about more about women and money. And I want us to answer this question after this. When you when you come back, do women also spend too much? Are they extravagant? Una 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 nyumbani. You you get back home and then you find things have been bought. The house is changed. The house is different. What is wrong, women? What is wrong? You you did not consult us when you're buying that thing you wanted to buy. Let's take a short break. We'll be back in a bit. Keep it locked. Keep engaging with us. This is Power Talk. Why two five four? Imagine. As always, keep engaging with us. I'm seeing so many comments on our Facebook page. Uh, that is at Y254 on our Facebook pl pl platform where you have asked what do women do with their money on our conversation right here on Power Talk. We are talking about women and money. I'm with Ruth and Violet here to talk about this particular issue. It is a girl's talk, and I want to attack the women today and speak on behalf of the men. So, gentlemen, I have you covered. What percentage of money do you control? In a man's life? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think we should control 100%. <laughs> you, see, you see, this is a problem. Why a hundred? And what percentage of your money should a man control? A man shouldn't control any percentage of my <laughs> money. <laughs> but reason being, Ram, our money, us will take care of your money. And that's a hundred percent. I personally have a friend who told me uh, he was married. He was married. So when the cash flow came to the bank, he never used to even touch the, the nini the finances that are in the bank, mm. the woman used to take care of that money. And he told me 100% the wife used to take care of his money, kabisa. Like he used, akwa nambiwati katikati ya month, hakuna sausages, hakuna nini, hakuna nini. Because we do take care of your money very well. And that's why we have to control, not, okay, so 100 is a bit extreme, 90% of your money. I'll, I'll make sure <laughs> so 100 is extreme, is so minus it's 10%. Minus 10% is Come on, that is easy key to... <laughs> no, see 10% na kupea kidogo So too. out of 100% of my money, I get to use 10%. Yeah. Mimi ni mungu. Violet, you agree with that? 
Yeah, okay. What I what I I believe in is uh it's it should be a partnership and you should agree. It's good that uh even if I don't touch 100% of your money, but at least I I know what we are doing. I think I money. think this thing of partnership you're just unatufunga tunayo macho. It's not it's not partnership. But I think we should. This is like full proprietorship. You are using 100% of my money. No, but you see the way she said about a friend who uh, alikuwa na, na handle pesa the, the husband in the bank and everything went on well. Yeah. I also know of a friend who, if it were not the wife, they would have been conned, seriously conned. Because it was the wife who gave the advice and told them, don't do this, invest here, don't invest here. Yeah, like women have Una intuition. Zua. Zua. Again, eh? Ati? Mm. Women have intuition. Intuition. Yeah, y- yes. y- Ilenye, you can sense yes. when we want to make yes, a bad I financial decision. Actually, oh. and we uh, we advised, uh. by the way, usi <laughs> invest apa, pesa itapotea. So it's it's good, even if we will not control 100% of your money, mm. it's good that we be honest with what we do with our money. Mm. So if you have pesa na apo, I love when you squander all the money outside there, and we are left there na shida, it's good that we, we both share. Also, at least... Uh, you don't come and squander all my money, by the way. You squander pesa yangu, atutapelekana vizuri. So, um, let's talk about manipulation. <laughs> and I'm using a very strong word today. Yes, please. Manipulation. Mm. Don't women manipulate men when it comes to money? Nini manasema apana, usweke pesa pale, weka pesa hapa. Mm-hmm. Pesa, mi nataka hi, nataka hi. Mm-hmm. And if you don't do that, mnanuna, so mm-hmm. and a man just has to but unajua, send. But it's for your own good and our own good. We Even if we are manipulating you, see, see in your to poteze pesa. It's for the good of us. It's in a positive uh, way. Us or you? <laughs> us. Ah. As a family. Because, you know, me, I want my kids to go to school, go to good schools. Na malize shulea some vizuri. So I'll make sure that when you control finances, zake, mm. it's in a way that is going to benefit the kid. It's going to benefit him and me. You, you know, we are not that selfish the, the way you're trying to put it. But <laughs> they will not attack us. I, but I'm <laughs> thinking, Ram, um, it's not <laughs> the reason as to why we really want to grasp whatever we, we can from uh, you people uh. is because most women say, Kama hayendi kwangu inenda kwa mtu mwingine. Exactly. So, I'd rather, m- I'd rather use as much as I can. Because mm-hmm. yes. in Nairobi now, things have really changed. Mm-hmm. So, kama hayendi kwangu inenda kwa mtu mwingine. So, so, so you would rather manipulate them, We the didn't man. say manipulate. That's not manipulation. What is, how, how do you term it? That's not manipulation. How do you term it? Uh, we just want to use your money well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We, are we just want to use well. it well. <laughs> in better places mm. so that's at a way we una strain mahali you know if we if you get to use your money well mm. out at talk angel window to take us chanaka kufurahisha cuz you don't have the money to do that you don't even do have that. the money to do that you don't have the money to but do that but this thing that makes you feel like you have all the money in the world and you can get any whatever woman you you, you can because mm. you have money that means your wife at home is not doing that thing <laughs> mm. yes and i have I, I have a friend who told me I have a friend who told me, mm. um, for me, I'd give my wife anything. But sit away and ati, for example, ni mnunulie gari, niandike jinaake, no. Shule ni mpeleke, no. That is a mean man. That is a mean man. Yet, yet, wewe mwenyewe unasema, ya kwamba a man who cannot bring something to the house is not a man. Aren't you being mean? Yet women, yet women are the no, same, same what people I actually saying, you want to control 100% of our money, of, of my money. Only to a 10%, 90% of your money. Ni tithe. Ni tithe. <laughs> 90%. Okay, we didn't, women are mean. We didn't say that if, ah. you, if you don't bring anything in the house that uh. you are a mean person, uh-huh. what we try to say, if you're not doing anything about it, you're, not you're just seated there, you're yeah. waiting for the man to go and, the woman to go and work, and bring you money and you you have all all it takes you have hands and legs you can go outside there and work no that is not being a man aren't women spendthrifts no but it depends as well uh-uh. let, let me, me tell let you me, ex- let, let me give you a very good example okay a very good example and i know all women all women including my own mother i know all women 
have this problem. <laughs> Wanatembea town. <laughs> <laughs> Wanaona kitu kwa glass. Mm. Ata kama alikuwa anaingia. Impulse buying. Anaingia tu. Mhm. Mm Anasema ah hii ni mzuri. Hii ni mzuri. Even the two of you I know you do that. <laughs> Tell me if I am lying. You're not lying. <laughs> Okay. You're not lying, and the, and why we do that? Then why should we trust you with 100% of our money if that's the character you have? Guess what? We already invested. We are, yes. we are just using whatever was whatever, left. Whatever is remaining. We didn't use it before. <laughs> we didn't use it before, Ram. Let me, the, most of them, including me, uh. when the money comes, mm -hmm. I make sure my rent is paid. Mm. My kid is sorted. My house girl is sorted. Everything is sorted. Then I put a bit for saving. Alafu ingine. Now this is mine. Nikitaka kwenda nione kitu and I buy. That's okay. There is no day you've ever bought something but you I plan. do. I do the same. Uh -huh. I have. The moment money come, comes in there, yeah, there is some that will go to the uh, my savings. Some will go to my rent. Some will go to my, uh, you know, those important things. To food. Whatever. The basic needs. And then whatever remains. No, that's when I'll start spoiling myself. Sometimes I may I may go overboard, but at least I know. Leo, the same ni metumia pesa yapa, but I know I will recover it. But the truth is, mm -hmm. and we women may recover it through RAM. Tu kwambia tuna pesa tutumia. Tutumia. Case close. No, it's true. You you overspend, overuse. No, we don't overspend. We just use what we you left. And you use the men as a recovery project. We don't the offer. Sisi ndio kama No, ni nyingi na offer ku idea. We didn't ask for your help. But you, your good heart and now your kindness. And your kindness. <laughs> Keeps us moving. Aki aki Eva Zochenga anasema the stronger the commitment, the greater the happiness. Nyinyi wanawake kando na meka pesa yenu nyinyi ni ya kufaidisha watu wa kwenu tuambiane tu mm. kweli wanawake mm. yes uh, uh, mwanamke yeye haendeshi kwake ha? haendeleshi kwake lakini wanawake na kwenu fuateni biblia tafadhali mtaacha baba zenu na mama zenu mfuatane na wanaume wenu tokeni huko kwenu huko Mimi, is that true? Nime, kitu nimeelewa, what he's trying to say is uh, when women get money, uh, anajaribu kusema, they invest more back home. Yes. Oh. And I, Anasema like, ha, ha, haweneleshi kuwake, lakini apana, munapeleka sasa, pesa uko. No, no, what you're supposed to do, it's good kwanza ujiendeleshe because mm. you are the one who's living there. But again, it's not good kama uko na pesa umejiendelesha and you're living home back home when things are not good. It's good pio kijiendelesha, you remember where you came from. Adi, Adi Milo, Kingori wa Magumo, <laughs> anasema, they just misuse money. Ladies can't see something big while they have money, they can't. Ni kuguza tu ni ni ki Ati, aki ni kikiguza tu msikamu inbox na wagopa. Eh, pole. Aota kuja inbox yako. <laughs> Usi, aota kuja inbox yako. But the, what Kingori anasema, okay. anasema ladies can see en, anything big when they have money. Mm -hmm. They misuse money. Mm -hmm. And that's what I was mentioning earlier. Mm -hmm. okay. Impulse buying. Mm -hmm. All of a sudden, you want that sofa. Mm -hmm. Unataka yo TV. Unataka mm -hmm. yo mm -hmm. microwave. Mm -hmm. Fridge. You know, to desire is one thing and to get it is another. another. We, but then we desire everything we see, even myself, even Ruth. Yeah. But now we need to think, for me to get that, how mm. much do I require? So it's not just about tuna, tuna, yes, tuna penda kila kitu. We are like that. At that one I agree. But now Pia, it depends. Do we go and get it? Mm -hmm. mm. Between a man and a woman, mm -hmm. who should control the money? Let me, let me, let me ask that. Who should control the money? The woman. Where it goes, and end up. Who should control? The woman. Who should control? I think it's the illiterate one. <laughs> <laughs> what it's do you mean? The illiterate one, because we can't say the women, and maybe there are some women who don't know how to use their finances. Okay. So it's it depends on the, f uh, the the setup. Maybe you and me, the one in, who's literate. In, in, a, in a case where they're both literate. It's not gender. It's in a case where they're both lit both literate. Both literate. Mm. The woman. 
Uh, now, mm -hmm. is it bad if a man chooses to have his own private investments and not inform you as a woman? I think it's bad if you are married. Same way, it's still bad for me to have a private investment and mm -hmm. not tell you. But women do that. Yes, we do that a lot of times. Yes. Munanuno V2, you invest somewhere, you buy land, mm -hmm. but you and you don't tell your men. Yeah, we mostly do that. Maybe, for example, if you have a child, you have to secure. These men are not reliable, reliable <laughs> these days. Sorry to say. But that's why we do that. We invest somewhere else because of our kids. But they mostly, Ram, what I can say on that. Mm. If you see a woman investing na hakwambi, it means kuna mali ya meona hauko 100% reliable. Yeah. Maybe wea ni mtu wana kuangalivia nona, maybe wea ni mtu wa kupenda wana wake, wawazi there. So anytime you can just walk out or bring me someone else so in the house. So if you don't tell me about your investments, so for me, I am down to be blamed. No, it depends with the other party. How do you, vile, vile muna relate. Because oh. me nikikuona you are the type of a person ni mtu wa kutembea huko nje and you're the kind of someone I don't see myself with in uh, some uh, in future in a longer period of time mm. truly I will invest and I will not let you know but if I feel I can rely on you we can talk we are open and honest mm -hmm. now hapo naweza kuambia it's not about you you tell me and me I don't tell you it's about your relationship how do you relate with each other? Wee kama ni mtu wa unapata pesa au ni kukunywa tu sherehe from Friday to <laughs> when is the like the holiday that is coming. Truly I will not tell you if I buy apartments worth millions or if I buy land all over Kenya. I will not I will not tell you. There are some women who normally say that mimi pesa si pati mwanaume. Si wezi pati mwanaume pesa. That's a ma that's um an illiterate woman and a very mean woman hakuna venye mwanamke tu anaweza amka aseme hiyo pesa sipati mwanaume mm -hmm. it's because maybe kuna mtu mwenye alimfanya e, kitu kuna vile ameonyeshwa kuna mm. venye kuna venye ameonyeshwa mm. but not not a normal woman can say that mm -hmm. carol let's, let's let's go to facebook eh hey, this comments leo muna eh hey, <laughs> it's on fire caroline ishmael <laughs> bring it up iko hapo juu ah, all right anasema Mwanaume hafai kushangaa akipata kitu mpya kwa nyumba because many men believe buying new household is a waste of money. So for me, I see no problem in buying things. I don't see the, a problem too. Me I believe a uh, uh, house the house is for the for woman. For the woman exactly. So if I bring visitors <laughs> exactly. but then yeah, don't, if I bring didn't you visitors, know that? You didn't know that? It is um, it's for the woman. Mean? It's for the woman. A house nyumba si yangu. Apana, lakini wewe ndo unalipa rent. Niwe ndo unalipa rent, mm. but ni sisi tunaiangalia. We are the ones to make sure. <laughs> nyumba ni ya nani? Nyumba. nyumba ni yako. Okay, nyumba ni yetu, but mimi ndo naiangalia. <laughs> <laughs> ni yetu anataka. Nyumba ni ya nani? Yetu. Ni yetu. But mimi ndo naiangalia. But the woman is the one who who looks after the house. Cuz I'm the one to tell you hakuna omo, hakuna nini mtoto anataka hii. So you see, mm. if visitors come to the house and find it untidy, awata sema ni wewe. Awata sema, eh, uyo bibi yako, mm. eh, ni sim safi. Mm. Uyo bibi yako, ata kutopea chai. So for me, I personally think the house is for the woman. But when mm. don't have your parents. <laughs> <laughs> the things I'm hearing today. <laughs> the things I'm hearing today. All right, um, let's talk about occasions. Valentine's, Women's mm -hmm. Days, you need all these occasions that we have mm -hmm. that of course mm -hmm. you make us spend money. If, mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> who should buy gifts for who? For, for the occasions, mm. if in a house to the man, if it is birthday, the woman can buy but gifts. But of course, for him. let's say the truth. <laughs> Most of these occasions in a house, one hour. Okay. Mm. Then the, 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 the guest yeah. should buy the yeah. gifts. So, it is you that gets all the uh, the good good yeah. things the uh. valentine but pia valentine it's uh ikwapo katikati but also you know there are these egoistic men who anasema mimi istaki kununuliwe you know the the toxic masculinity istaki ku celebrate valentine istaki hiyo ni mambo ya wasichana nyinyi tu ndio mnajingiza kwa hiyo mess lakini nyinyi mnataka tu tununulie eh sisi now you have to pamper us but the way if you are not pampered during valentine 
there's a, there's a message inakuambia hapo hata if you if you have someone and he's not pampering you and he has money during valentine i don't think we call the same page <laughs> <laughs> Ruth? <Would> you <laughs> at a no, birthday you know i'm wondering uh. as as we love the good life and we also love gifts for me gifting makes me feel good not only me being given a gift even me gifting someone for me i really feel good gifting people so for occasional i think i want to be gifted if it's your birthday i'll gift you vice versa gift me and it's not a give or take but but in in um, most occasions on most occasions it's about the women women's day i'll gift you girls day I'll gift you. Valentine's Day, I'll gift you. Together. Mother's Day, I'll gift you. Huh? Which one? But international women down. International women yeah. I'll gift you. But but you know Ram, if at times we sit down and feel as if unaona ni kama you're being a I am being a burden to you and at times we mean getting. No, there is uh, 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 <laughs> You will go look for someone else because siku kupata ki. See your gift. Uh, mm. When you feel as if you're ba- you are a burden to someone. Now Not the problem that I, one one problem I have with most ladies is yes, yes. when it comes to your turn mm-hmm. buying us gifts you give us a sock a pair of socks. <laughs> I love us kwa na namnataka si tunue fridge. <laughs> See that's why mkona pesa. Nikona. Alafu mkona shida. Huyu mwanaume ni mtu mbali sana. Yeah, socks na vest. I have provided for this man. Na umenunua sahani moja yenye hata ni mabati. Na hata situmiangi kwa nyumba juu mimi nakula nje. Na socks ambayo imeparara. It doesn't depend on the gift. It's imetoka kwa roho mm-hmm. not hata naweza naweza ku gift sweetie na ikuwe very intentional ama fridge na ikuwe ilikuwa forced eh <laughs> it highly depends the gifting should be intentional that's it intentional let me personalize this question okay what does money symbolize mm-hmm. for you for us money uh, I, individually uh uh-huh. Individually, and then <laughs> talk about a, a woman now. What does money symbolize for you? Money. Mm. It's just a source of um, comfort. Mm. It's it's just an addition, because uh, money is not everything to me. Uh, you've said you are personalizing. Yes, for you. It may not be everything to me, but if uh, money is very necessary, okay. it's very necessary. Oh. So to me, it's like a sense of uh, comfort na freedom or about to a woman to a woman to a woman generally <laughs> i don't know why they feel like it's all about uh ni love i don't mm. know why they think when uh kipewa pesa ni kumaanisha mtu anakupenda ruth what does <laughs> <laughs> what does money symbolize for you first of all as an individual as an individual money symbolizes freedom for me money is good but the love of it is what is bad So I don't love money but napenda pesa bado but the love of it is bad but for me money is freedom and money gives me comfort as a woman as a um as a woman mm. uh, I think it gives you the access to speak out let me tell you Ram women not I'm not saying that if they don't have money they can't speak out but it gives you a sense of power in the society now I have I have heard many women say this I've not had men say this. Not even a single man unless there is kama uko kamera man wetu unless yeye amewe sema kitu kama hiyo. Ama Aaron pale. I've had mm-hmm. people say this. Women say this. Mm-hmm. Afadhali nilie kwenye Range Rover. Mm-hmm. Kuliko ni cheke <laughs> kwenye boda boda. Mhm. Mhm. Wote cheka kwa boda boda. Good question. So, uh, now I wonder Mm-hmm. What does money symbolize? Mm-hmm. You would rather cry in a Range Rover mm-hmm. than laugh mm-hmm. and rejoice mm-hmm. in a Boda Boda. Why? Mm-hmm. Because I've never heard a man say such a thing. Mm-hmm. So women. 
<laughs> me according to me i'm not saying uh kucheka kwa boda boda is a good thing uh. but but uh i choose peace honestly i choose a uh, a house full of peace there's no point in a house full of money without, without peace. peace yeah that's according to me yeah. so if you want to cry in dubai or in a range rover kichapo kila siku you can as well go ahead but as for me oh. uh, that one uh, that one will not work for me so you, you between crying in a range rover and um, yeah, and, 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 and laughing in a border border no, the, you, you know the border border part is uh, f- uh, f- it's not there to stay something that will pass Ruth, Ruth? i conquer with her and mm. this is personal to me ah. um there's a time where you want to stay somewhere because of maybe some the things that you get maybe because uh the baby is getting this and this mm. but now when you realize your mental pe- uh, your mental peace mm-hmm. comes first that makes the, all the difference mm-hmm. and then the time that i got my mental peace is has been everything so what women me. should be looking out mm-hmm. for mm-hmm. instead of just money mm-hmm. is having that mental peace, peace of mind yes with the, with all honesty it's good that you follow peace of mind for the sake of your generation because yeah. if you yeah. have this kid who's not who's in a house without peace you know you expect that kid at a grown vile amekuona if ame grow akiona mnachapana kila siku that man that ka small man or that ka small woman she will yeah. grow akijua this is the way fighting is the way yeah. so it's good that you choose peace over this acha na iki here here ya pesa by the way na ya ya rich 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 <laughs> you yeah, know yeah. rich auntie uh. yeah just choose peace work hard and put god first mm. the rest I've, will follow i've i've not talked about sugar daddies but let me let me move uh. to something else because <laughs> <laughs> i still wonder yeah, we, i can still t- answer why women yes would want to go for sugar daddies mm-hmm. but mm-hmm. um there's so many issues we've not touched on. Mm. Let me talk about having joint accounts. Mm-hmm. Would you prefer that um, a man and a woman um, gets uh, mm-hmm. joint yeah. account? Yes. Uh, like for me, I, I, I highly recommend that because I'm one, uh, me mean one of them, mm. but I'll be the one who will be uh, the holder of the account. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes. So uh, for that, okay. <laughs> uh, Ruth? So I have this uh, I have this scenario where uh, I have a couple that have separated they have a joint account but now in this joint account bwana and ambianga bibi pay that rent you know you can't always ikata mm. they've separated but they're living in the same apartment different houses mm. so since you have a joint account he feels or he feels um he he can ask for that money anytime all right uh-huh. it is good to have the joint account but as l- as long as you don't have control over it as a woman <laughs> I, I i know I yes <laughs> me I, I have control over the joint account uh, uh, l- 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 um, Tim- timothy Ebu, um uh, nimona you've told me to uh, about the facebook page pale uh, let me read that comment when you were up with lewisa muridhi anasema mwanaume ni kama stima akirudi apaswi kuulizwa ametoka wapi piga sherehe akili pumzike work day rauka fanya kazi uh, de, day v lubi anasema why is she having confident with my money i should have confident na yao pia if we are partners hao ni wale wakiachwa wanasema huyo mwanaume adi akunisaidia na kitu eh uh, kwani unaogopa ground kwani uko uko hustle wewe akarika <laughs> wewe <laughs> Uh Deno okay and asama loving the show nikiwa MK you think so much Deno I appreciate it man Richard MC anasema that's why sijawahi ku dream uh, kumari who is above me aki uh, sinta regacious live kwa nyumba uh, man save a lot uh uh men save a lot she's just single but when women appears and yeah <laughs> <laughs> si semi kitu si semi kitu <laughs> si semi kitu <laughs> zina disappear zina disappear <laughs> 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 well, the, 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 i don't know i don't know if 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 it is true there, there is i i had a social media influencer saying that women 
uh, uh, suck all the money from men. Mm -hmm. So if a man is single and mm -hmm. doing well financially, the moment he gets mm -hmm. a woman, mm -hmm. the money just disappears. It's never there. She, she's not the right woman for you. Akuna, akuna haja ungangane. If she comes in and you had saved and all the money gets sucked, then she's not the right woman for you. She's, that, she's just there for the money. Just find someone who wants to save with you, who wants to grow with you. All right. Mm -hmm. But I got to Malaysia. And ladies, mm -hmm. I'm a supporter of women. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, you have jumped to this side, eh? Ah? No, I have not jumped. Like, I told you, 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 I empowerment. Mm -hmm. Be empowered and uh, use it outside there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but thank you so much, Ruth. Thank you so much, Ram. Thank you so much, Violet. Thank you so much, Ram. Mm. Thank and of you. course, I want us to end with a quote there. Timothy, bring it up. A woman's best protection is a little money of her own. Do you believe in that? Do you agree? A woman's best protection is a little money on her own. That brings us to the end of this morning conversation right here on Power Talk. A big thanks to Ruth and Violet. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. Thank uh, you. And of course, pass my regards to your bosses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, 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 we we shall. I know he's watching. My name is Ram Maguko. As always, it has been a pleasure. When it comes to women and money, this conversation can never end. And of course, keep it locked right here on Power Talk. And of course, I repeat of this, your airs again tonight at 10. 10 p.m. May God bless you. May God bless the work of your hands. This is Power Talk.